kid, what are you doing? I'm trying to get I'm going to tell you it's never going to sit up and beg. Come on, we're going to go. I'm not really in the mood. No arguments. I need your help here. With what? Come with me, you'll find out. When the wildebeest walks in, we all act surprised and we're very friendly. The wildebeest? His boss. boss. Oh, I thought we were here about our quest. Mine is to be fabulous all year long, and my contract is up for renewal, so... This man always has a plan. I'm so sorry I can't stay. But I need you. But I told Jason it wins about my quest. You did? I don't want just any job. I want a future I will be passionate about. Something that will lead to great things, like an empire I can be the head of. And how did that go down with Jason? He said that was really great, but if I didn't do an interview for a job in packaging, he'd cut off my benefit. I stink. I know. Well, it's a start, right? Who knows, I might end up running the company. Maybe. I know, who am I kidding? Oh well, wish me luck. Go well. Go you, go girl. Woo! Don't say go girl. Why? It's embarrassing. We're on, we'll finish these later. That's the wildebeest. You do not call her that to her face. Willa, <laughs> hi. Mm. Mm, fancy seeing you here. Uh, these are my friends, Ted, Alice, Candy. This is Willa East, my adorable boss. Hello. Hi. My assistant, Tiana. Oh, you didn't. The little bird said it might be a special day. Happy birthday. There are no oh. accidents where Levi's concerned. Oh, my goodness. Well, check out the bling. It's gorgeous. You were such a greaser. I was going to say, darling. <laughs> this is fun? Yeah. So, Diana, what's it like working with Levi? Ah, oh, maze walls. He knew Willow was down about turning 40, so he got me to bring her here. He's so thoughtful. Uh, he's a good dude, all right? Yeah, and he's happy for a pay rise. Ah, uh, clever dude. Well, Levi always says luck is just making the most of opportunity. Wish I could manage that. Oh, that was such a workout. You moved like a dream. Oh, stop it. Hey, we were thinking of moving on. Willa suggested her place. Oh, uh, I'm not sure, eh? Woo! <laughs> she doesn't have many friends, so I've got a chin line. Oh, good are you. I like Willa. I wanted her to have a good birthday. And uh, give you a pay rise next week. They got you under the house. Yeah. Now you're having fun? Yeah. I'm sorry, I've got to start it now. Oh, hey, happens to me all the time. And score, this place is great. Woo! It's nice having people around. It's been a bit empty since. I swore I wouldn't do this. Talk about my ex. I just broke up with my fiance. He was oh. cheating on him. Oh, men are bastards. But I like you. I like all of you. Especially you. Happy birthday. I haven't had this much fun in a long, long time. <gasps> OMG, is she breathing? Oh, I think she's just out to it. Ah, oh, sweet as. Right. Who's up? Are we having fun yet? Be. Great. So great you're training pot plants in your spare time. So what do we think Sarah is doing right now? You must have gone there. Not really. Her and her husband in their flash hotel in Melbourne, that king-size bed. Don't. I'm sure she lies back and pretends it's oh, you. Oh, leave, leave it alone. Has anything actually happened between you? We've kissed. And then? Well, we talked a bit. You haven't got your end away even once. That's not what it's about. The point is, you're young. You're single. You need to make the most of it. Sarah isn't here. Hey, what about her? She's friendly, available, not the brightest bulb in the tree. But she's Perfect. your boss. God, you really do like them older, don't you? I mean, Tiana. Oh, I don't know. Don't think so. Ted, I had to say you're getting a wee bit boring. You hang around home all moony and mopey, and if your best friend can't tell you... No, I'm going for a slash. Don't use all the hand cream? It's all right for Mr. to make it happen. Some of us don't have the same kind of chances. <laughs> he is single. And he's a great guy. Have you seen the bard landscaper? <laughs> Team 
Oh my god, well it was free! <laughs> <laughs> Take it off the list. I won a G-string. <laughs> but it's a clean-up reward. <laughs> <laughs> I'll carry you. We'll run outside. That was such a fun night. Yeah, it was a bit of a laugh, eh? <laughs> and now... It's like we were never here. Oh, you look terrible. What happened to you? Oh, I got badly leave on. What happened to you? Nothing, just a bike accident. <laughs> You've been for a run. Quick 5k? Why does he never get a hangover? Good God, what happened to you? Mitchell's back. Gotcha. Don't. We're only concerned for your safety. And anyone else in the immediate vicinity? Well, don't be, because I'm fine. I'll catch you guys later. What is it with Keegan's and hopeless unrequited love? Me and Sarah are not hopeless. <laughs> oh, crap. Last night, I, uh... Wore a woman's dressing gown? I drunk and dialed. <laughs> See? You and Benny, what a pair. <laughs> Maybe we are. Maybe this lack of control over things is genetic. Our SVP list finalised. PA and LCD is being delivered to the venue at four. Finalist furniture. shots. Uh, collated on this USB, ready for you to approve. I trust you, darling. Thank you. But I have one last look, just to be on the safe side. Morning. Morning, Willa. Mm -hmm. Oh, and thank you for last night. Even though I may have had a little bit too much to drink. Hey, what goes on tour, etc. Mm -hmm. And it was a fab night? It was. Uh, do I need to ask anything about the awards? That's all under control. All you need to do is turn up looking beautiful. Mm -hmm. Bless you, Levi. The higher plants for the foyer are being delivered this afternoon. You should check them out. I already approved them. Well, you could have another look and say hi to Ted for me. Oh, I didn't really get the feeling he was interested. I think he might be. Did he say something? Who could not adore you? You take a long lunch and have fun. Thank you so much. Hey, enjoy. Do your worst. Hi, it's Sarah. Leave me a message. Shit, it's a week. I call her, she doesn't call back. And maybe she is having a great time over there in the king-sized bed. Hi there. G'day. Levi wanted me to approve the plants again. Well, here they are. Again. They look good. Again. Great. And I have to say, you look way better without the robe. You guys were hilarious. So why don't we get to you and your bra and knickers? Oh, shit, that sounded way dodgy. Play your cards right, you never know. So did that. Oh my goodness, you must think I'm such a hussy. I don't. Oh, good. And do you want to get some lunch after this? Well, well, why not, Sarah? It's not as if I've heard from you. It's not as if you care. Have you already had lunch? No. Let's do it. Bevo. Why not? Maybe it's time I took advantage of some opportunities. Bad news. The MC dropped out. What? But I got someone else. At such short notice. Well, Simon Dallow, dude. How'd you pull that off? My brother knows him. Dear mate, you're a star. Thanks. So, how things go with Tess? Um, we had lunch, and Benny told me he's in love with someone else. Who told you that? Mom. You knew? I thought you could help him move on. Oh, apparently we've lost the MC for the awards. It's okay, breathe. Who needs some crusty on fart when we've got Simon Dallow? Really? Levi, you are such a star. Everything's sorted, trust me. Oh, what would I do without you? Have you finished with the glam shots? Good to go. I shouldn't resent Levi. He goes for what he wants. McMahon. Oh, no paparazzi! Oh. <laughs> if 
fake photographers were a genius idea. Some of them are real. We'll definitely make the North Shore Chronicle. Hold that thought. Looking gorgeous, lady. Oh. Champagne at the bar? Oh my god. You didn't tell me he was coming. Who? Well, do you want to know what it takes to be a stupid man? Fine. So sorry. It's fine. Are you okay? I think I'm gonna dry off. I'm really sorry. She always is klutzy. Hey mate, catch up soon. Wildebeest in the house. There's boss. Oh, oh. Is Benny okay? Oh, she'll be fine. Has she ever had her eyes checked? Well, she does wear glasses sometimes. She might need a recheck. She's quite clumsy. Could be an eyesight issue. Mostly when she looks at you. The place looks fantastic. Hollywood glamour, complete with palms. Mm -hmm. Oh, shite. Damage control. Excuse me. Go wave your magic wand. This is my table. I was here first. Stay where you are, Nan. We're not moving. I just want to see that man over there. He looks just like Simon Della. Oh, don't be so silly. Excuse me, is there a problem? I need this table. I need to be closer to the front. <laughs> oh, do you now? <laughs> I'm North Shore's number one agent, six years running. And because you steal other people's listings. Nancy, I reserved a table just here, especially for you. Really? My best table, just next door. <sighs> Is she getting special treatment? Actually, this table's way better, but keep it to yourself. And good luck for tonight. Did you hear that? Let me know something. It is Simon Dallow. Congratulations, Janet. <laughs> Hi. Hey. So what did I miss? Not much. Nice dress. And now, the big one, the award for North Shore's top two real estate agents for 2013. And the runner-up, number two salesperson on the North Shore is... Nancy Ping. Yes, she's number two. Take that, Nancy Ping. <laughs> At least she gets to meet Simon Dello. <laughs> I am number one, Fran McMahon. Fran! <laughs> Me and tell him to get his gear off. <laughs> and here we go. This is the big one. Number one North Shore real estate agent for 2013 is Piet and Betty Bryce. <laughs> oh my god, sorry, Mum. Oh my day. Bloody South Africans, as if the Asians weren't enough. Oh my friggin' God. I know. No. Oh. Sorry, I'm not quite sure what's happening here. Shit. Ted, what are you wearing? Oh, shit. It's an interesting one. Oh. This can't be the plan. There must have been a mix up. Oh, no. Oh, my God. It's that McMahon girl. She's a bad girl. No, she's not. OMG, how bad is this? You're a bad girl, just like your mother. No, she's not a bad girl. I'm the bad girl. What are you talking about? Hey. <gasps> Shit. That's gone hot. Oh, bloody Nora. Not another lizard in the family. Stop. Willa! Willa! It was just a bit of fun. I'm so sorry. I don't know how those pictures got on there. It doesn't matter how. The fact is it turned to shit. You stay here. Do the pack out. I've got to get to Willis. Talk her down. Or maybe I should go and see her. Why? To explain. Because it's my fault and I should tell her. Are you sure? Yes, of course. I have to face up to the consequences. Take that, you slut. <laughs> <laughs> God, not again. This isn't how it goes. Not for Levi, not ever. 
Look where you started. Oh my god, I did, didn't I? You are so bad. Yes, I am. <laughs> At least the cat fight was classic. Nope. Not ready to see the funny side yet. Benny left with Mitchell. The world really is upside down. But you know it'll be okay. You can turn it around. You always do. Sure. Well, the loves me. I mean, what would you do without me? That's Levi. He always bounces back. And maybe he's right. You do have to go for it. Is she in there? She is, and I did talk to her. You're an angel. Hi. Do you invite white? Date and orange scone? Feeding time for the wildebeest, is it? Sorry? You've never called me the wildebeest? Well, yes. Willow East. Uh, wildebeest, it's an easy transition, a joke. And I really admire you, you know that. You admire me so much so that you went through my things, wore my clothes, took photos, and then put them up in front of a room full of clients and Simon Dallow. It was a mix up. Didn't Tiana explain? Uh, yeah, she apologized and explained everything. It was. Drunken idiocy. Or true colours. Buttering me up to get a pay rise. You know I work hard, I pull out the stops. And get Simon Dallow. I give instructions to my assistant. What can I do to make this better? You can kiss my fat white wildebeest ass. How'd it go? She's not renewing my contract. Oh, shame. I packed your things. What exactly did you say to her? I did say the photos were a mix up. Totes. Have you finished with the glam shots? Good to go. You switched them deliberately. Well, you're never going to get a raise because Willa needs to cut costs and at least she appreciates what I do and my current pay is hardly anything. You're taking my job. Well, we haven't finalised the details yet. Oh, you evil little cow. That's not very nice. What about toxic dwarf? Underhand backstabbing bitch. Levi, I'm sorry that you're angry because it was so amazing while I was working with you and I did learn heaps. Like making the most of opportunities? This is so not over. Mm, it is for you. Oh, wells. <laughs> There's luck and taking control. <laughs> and then there's being totally shafted. That is awful. She is so bad. She seemed like such a ditzoid. When she started, she was an airhead in a bubble skirt. I raised her up, taught her everything. She thought Moet and Shandon was a suburb in Christchurch. <laughs> she thought Cambria was a cheese. Is it not? No. Oh. And after all that, she shafted me. She even smiled while she was doing it. I'm totally in the game now. Tequila. What game? It's a silly quest thingy. Go girls quest. Yeah, whatever. But this is what I want. A new job, a better job. That'd be far too easy. Oh, I wish. I have something simple in mind, something positive, goal oriented. I will ruin Tiana's life. <laughs> you want revenge? Of course. It doesn't sound all that positive. But he has a quest that's great. Yes. To crush Tiana into midget pulp. <laughs> Tiana will be dead and long live the queen. And this, I solemnly swear. Good on you, babe. Yay for Levi. He's taking control. Thank you. Making the most of his opportunities. Yes. But that might not always be such a good thing. <laughs> Celebration party.